Hey, Bike Smuggers, how's it going? Man, I'm playing Harlow here once again. Y'all doing all right? There's Sunday evening here. Fixing to get the horses in for my quick video. Hope you had a good Thanksgiving. Now Thanksgiving weekend. Hope y'all got to spend a good time with your family and friends and all that good stuff. And hope you got stuffed. Because I did. But, uh, I think I gained about an extra 15 pounds this weekend. Maybe even more. I don't know. My pants are fitting a whole lot tighter. I can do that much right now. But, uh, little barrel. I guess you'd consider that a Canadian, wouldn't you? I consider it a Canadian. It's itty bitty short Canadian. I really like this little pipe. Pretty cool. Little barrel pipe. Uh, this is a Greek made, a Greek made pipe, I think, wasn't it? Yeah, made in Greece. But uh, I got some uh, ideal in it from Schwab here. Uh, anyway, let's get on to the purpose of this video here. I'm uh, I'm gonna try and do a pipe trick if anybody's interested. I got a pipe that sits around. I don't smoke it. Um, I've I've not enjoyed it. Um, it ain't perfect. But it just ain't been, it ain't, it ain't been one of my favorites, and I don't smoke it very often, um, very rarely. And I said, sitting here wasting space, and I've had a lot of people comment on this pipe more than any pipe I own. Where'd you get that? Where'd you get that? Where'd I find one? Where'd I... There ain't many of them out there that I know. Um, but maybe somebody's interested in it and uh, wants to do a trade. If not, so be it. That's cool. But uh, I just wanted to give somebody an opportunity if they did want it, and they can do some trade. But. My Paranelli Camouflage Poker. Like I said, it is not perfect. Um, this pipe was originally, uh, I think, this line, this is from what I can remember now. You may want to do some research. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me, I'm starting to get cold here. <coughs> I'm trying to fight it off with some idea. But uh, from what I was told, these pipes, they're true briar pipes. Um, Perinelli makes them, um, and they, I think it was, they're dipped in fiberglass, or they do something with them, I can't, I'm not sure, it's just a coating that's on them, um, similar pipes, because Schwab's carries that line, and they've got probably 20 pipes that are like that, the different styles of pipes, different styles of colors, different, all kinds of different stuff, American flags, camouflage, blue camouflage, black and blue camouflage, snow camouflage, I mean, it's just random stuff, this is the only poker they had. But uh, most of those pipes are running, I think around 100 to $125 brand new. This pipe was purchased by me brand new, but it, like I said, it is not perfect. I got it marked down. Um, I guesstimate this pipe being anywhere in the worth range of my in my fairness and best guess, best judgment. I ain't no expert, but from what I paid for it, um, it's a lot more than what I think it's worth. <laughs> I think it's worth uh, probably 50 to $65. I think it's a fair fair amount for this pipe being worth. It's been smoked about, I hate to say, under 20 times. I'm gonna say under 20 smokes, 20 full bowls of smokes. I mean, it's a big old bowl. Uh, it's, I'd say I'd say it's been under 20. It's one of my first pipes. Um, but here we go, on to it. Like I said, it's not perfect. First thing, I may not have a very good lighting. If you're interested in this, Want to see more pictures? You got more questions? Holler at me, PM me. Um, I can send you some pictures because the lighting may not be very good. But if you are interested, just let me know. I'll get you better pictures. If you got any questions, ask me. I'll, I'll answer it to the best of my abilities. Um, the bowl is not perfect. You see right here how it's made and see. You can see the oblongness to it, not the actual bowl itself, but on the outside. See how long the straight edge is. And how it's not over here. This is like a. It's kind of like a second, I assume. Um, it does have a mark there, right there. A chip has been knocked out of it. Um, where the. It's not a chip knocked out, it's just the. The coating's coming off and the bear's showing. The briar's showing. And there's another mark right here. In my finger. It does need to be cleaned up. I am going to clean it up real good. I just want to put this video up. 
and see if anybody's interested. My plan to give it a good thorough cleaning. Um, we do have a very small amount of chatter marks on the bottom of the stem. You probably can't even see them. You can feel them more than you can see. This is a clear stem. You can see a little bit of the chatter marks there. No holes, nothing like that. I didn't even chewed all the crap. This pipe's so heavy. It's not much of a clincher. I mean, it's not super heavy. Don't get me wrong. It's just... It's the heaviest pipe on. Because it's a big pipe. I mean... You're looking at a beast here. That's big. And I got big hands. I mean, I'm, I, I really do have big hands. See how deep that bowl is. Well, not with that finger we ain't. <laughs> it's a deep bowl. That's my second knuckle. So... About that deep. Pretty deep bowl. Um... I will go and uh, do a good clean up on it. If anybody's interested in it. Um, I'm not satisfied with it. And it may be because I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know. I have told some other people this. Um, this right here, I think it's just a smudge. I just now know. I was just looking at that. I think it's just a. Uh, a smudge or something. That'll probably get cleaned off. That little smudge there. Um, there's that mark again. And the bowl's pretty dirty at the top. Need to be cleaned up real good. Um, but here's the markings, the Perinelli markings on it. It says Perinelli right here on the shank, but you can't see it. Very good. There we go, maybe. Um, my pipe's out. My problem with the pipe is this, and it may be, I loved it at first, um, but I didn't know much about pipes. What a flame on this, hang on. That gun. Like I got a water pipe over here. Let me clean this out real quick. Go here, gurgling. Boy, I'll tell you what. More better. Somewhat. <laughs> this ain't the best smoking pipe ever, but it is all right. <laughs> I like it still. Uh, <laughs> I think the problem with this is it needs good deep cleaning. But uh, anyway, this pipe here. The one that I'm trading. <laughs> Maybe. It, uh, like I said, it may be something I'm doing. I don't know. It may need a good deep clean. It may fix it. I don't know. I'm not an expert on pipes. Um, I just I kind of I pick some stuff up along the way. But here's what I don't like about it. I will clean it out real good with bristle brush, pipe cleaners, regular. I have that thing come out clean. Real good and clean. And then I'll go to, uh, I'll stuff a bowl up and I'll start smoking it. And it could be my smoking habits. That's very possible. I think I'm a pretty wet smoker. But, um. And I probably am smoking too fast still. I'm still trying to figure all this stuff out. I've gotten a lot better, but I'm st I'm probably still smoking too fast. Um, uh, I'll light it up. I'll smoke it, probably quarter of the bowl down. And I'm having to run a pipe cleaner through it. I'll get that juice, juicy nastiness. I'll take about another five, six, seven, eight puffs. I'll run another pipe cleaner down, and it comes back dirty. It's just getting dirty quick. I don't know why. I really don't. Honestly, I, I don't know why. And it may be something, like I said, it may be something I'm doing. It may just be a crap pipe. I don't know. A lot of people, I don't know nothing about Perinelli's. I don't know if it's a good brand. I have no idea. So, just putting that out there, I don't want to try and sell somebody something that they don't want. Because that ain't what I'm wanting to do. Because if that's what I, I, just, I can't, I ain't like it. That's not me. I'm not that kind of guy. I want you to know exactly what you're getting when you get it. And that's the reason I don't like it. Right there. It's because I'll smoke it for 10 minutes and I'm spitting juice out of my mouth. <laughs> Like I'm dipping or something and it's coming. No, it ain't that bad. But you know what I'm saying. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I hope. Uh, and I'm just not a big poker fan. I'm really not. Yeah, I need to do some cleaning on that. Excuse my gurgling noises and funny sounds from my wife. Yeah, it's done. <laughs> <laughs> That needs a good clean. Uh, but 
I, I'm just not, I thought I would like pokers, and I'm just not really enjoying them. Um, I've, there's a lot of the pipes I've, 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 most of my pipe collection are straight pipes. Straight shank pipes, such as this one. Um, that's what I liked when I first started, and that's what I started buying. Now, y'all see me smoking this pipe non-stop, and I do smoke this pipe non-stop. I'm surprised I haven't burned it out yet, because I smoke it so much, because I love it. Um, nice bent stem, it's much more comfortable for me. I don't have many bent pipes, and that's what I'm wanting to do. I'm wanting to get back into getting into bent pipes more. So I've got quite a few straight pipes, and I just uh, actually got another one. I won, I won one on eBay this weekend. Uh, I got a Savinelli coming in, y'all. Go check that out. Got a good deal on it. A little cleanup work, and I think it'll be all right. But anyway, um, I want. I just. I'm not a big fan of the pokers. I'm really not. Uh, I, I. I like the billiards and the short stubby billiards and stuff. But I'm just not a huge fan of pokers, and I don't like them. I don't like as much as I thought I would. But uh, that's another reason I'm getting rid of it. I just don't smoke it. It's just not for me. It's a, it's a handful. I mean, it's a big pipe. It ain't one you go on clinch. I mean, it's a it's a hoss cat. I mean, it's it's a big pipe. I'm sure there's bigger pipes. Um, if you want me to weigh it for you, I can. I think I've got some scales light enough to pick up the weight on that. I think I can. I can think I can actually get the the real weight if you'd like to measurements. I can get all that. Um, if anybody's interested, let me know. Um, like I said, I'm looking more towards. Uh, I like bent pipes, I like billiards, I like bent billiards, I like chubby billiards, I like pots, I like, I want a Dublin, I've been looking for Dublin, um, Dublin shaped pipe, I need something, with, I want something with a tapered bowl to smoke flakes in, um, if you got anything like that, um, anything, as long as it ain't junk, and it's, you know, I mean, don't try to rip me off, honestly, I think, I paid, I paid, I don't remember what I paid, to be honest with you, I think I paid around, I don't want to say, I can't remember, to be honest with you. Um, but I honestly think, I feel that it's worth around 50 or 60 bucks. Um, honestly. So if you got something that you think you, that you're tired of and want to trade, then hire right, me, you know, and whatever. Or maybe you got a couple pipes, a couple cheap pipes. Dr. Graybo, I'll smoke a fire out of one. What you talking about? You know, and I just don't want, you know, tell me a couple of them. We'll call it a deal. You know, I don't know. Just tell me what, show me what you got. PM me, do whatever. Uh, if anybody's interested, because I just know I've had a lot of interest in this pipe. I've had a lot of people ask about it, but I will, uh, I'll get to clean, I'm going to try to get it cleaned up tonight. We'll see what happens. If you're interested, PM me. Uh, if you don't hear back from me, because YouTube's all jacked up, I'm still trying to figure it out. I got most of it under my belt. Uh, if I'm on, if you're on Instagram, shoot, shoot a message at me in one of my pictures or something, because I know a lot of you guys are on Instagram, and I'll probably put some pictures on Instagram of it, up for trade or something, uh, once I get it cleaned up. But I'm going to try to do a deep clean tonight if I can. We'll see what happens if I'll be able to get down here or not and uh, get a good clean to it or not. But uh, like I said, if anybody's interested, just shoot me a PM. Um, I don't want to sell it outright. I'd rather trade. If somebody's interested in buying it outright, then I mean, maybe we could do that. But I would rather tra trade. No money involved. Just trade out. Um, oh, pipe rack. I need a pipe rack. You got a pipe rack? Shoot me up. You know, um, I'd rather get at least one pipe in a pipe rack. I don't need nothing fancy as a pipe rack. But if you got a pipe rack you want to get rid of, hey, I may need it because I've got it's a mess. <laughs> I just got pipes piled up. So I need to give me a pipe rack. Uh, maybe. I don't know. I'm debating building a pipe rack. So I may go that route and build a pipe rack. But if anybody's interested in here it is one more time. It's a Paranelli Poker. I know this is a long, drawn-out video. I'm super sorry. If you're interested, PM me, holler at me, Instagram me, Vox me. I'm on Voxer, Aaron Harlow. Type it in, you'll find me. Double A-R-O-N-H-A-R-L-O-W. You can find me. Shoot me a boxer, and uh, I'll try to get some pictures or something. Whatever you want to know, any information, I can measure it, I can weigh it, all that good stuff. I feel like I'm rambling. I'm getting out of here. Y'all keep that smoke around a little hot. Later, see it.